Hi, welcome to this tutorial. We are going to install Arch Linux GNOME. We have a virtual box in the tutorial of Eric Dubois. We started with a base installation and we've done already an installation. We're gonna discard this one and start again. So this is the base installation. We clone it. We tell the system that we're gonna make uh, Arch Linux GNOME full clone and we are working at this point in time let's have a quick look on a version of 4.9.6 kernel zsh4511 cinnamon 3.7 a special kind of dark arc dark smoke made with the github from eric dubois at um, arc theme colora and a special kind of Sardi Mononumix Colora Vampire. So that's the system we run. We're going to start to make our Arch Linux GNOME. So we have installed, done all the steps we had to do until Xorg and XF, uh, the, the, the driver, the graphical drivers. And we start from there. Clone uh, Git is already installed. So sudo pacman minus s is not necessary i do need to type in my password otherwise i can't do it so we did clone some scripts that are online and we're gonna find them here at the github.com slash eric dubois slash arch and then you decide what desktop to take so cinnamon i3 budgie this time you know when things are too slow you do ctrl c and you do it again this is a normal speed cd cd arch gnome ls cd installation ls and ls minus aux is better we have to run all the things with numbers in front we start at the zero two install the faucet arch servers we're gonna s spare us some time and the servers will be just fine sudo pacman minus syu and as you can see now there's still one mirror list too well we've updated the mirror list so we have the best possible how convenient so three is um, install oops zero three so slash the zero three is the x org let's see what we can install at the ati i mean intel video virtual box of course since we're working on virtual box i don't have to decide whether i'm having an nvidia or an ati you just figure that out yourself open the box or look at the stickers on the laptops or google it and make your choice we have another choice to make here in virtual box we have to decide for number two here Virtual box guest modulus arch, yes. And there we are. So that's the X org and the driver for the graphics. And then for oh there we go again. 04. We're going to install the packer. Packer is an AUR helper, arch user repository, and then most importantly we're gonna install GNOME. Not only GNOME, we're gonna install GNOME Extra as well. It's just my decision, so if you don't want it, just omit it, delete it, put the hashtag in front, it's all these things work. And last but not least, GNOME and the Display Manager GDM go hand in hand, so I'm installing as well GDM to have an easy login and have a display manager afterwards let's save some time here we're at the end we could now sudo reboot as it is suggested here or we can go ahead and go on running it in terminal and uh, other tutorials of always when I always went to to boot and then go to the display manager so why not continue this uh, tutorial by just clicking enter here and staying in our terminal.
it's going to take going to install a lot of software so good time to save some time as well here okay next up is 110 install the printers password the sound and the network and then we go to number 200 the extra software is going to be installed in this case I did not load it up with a lot of software, just new fetch, Spotify and Sublime Text. Used to be Dropbox, in sync and all that, so we can do that later. Save some time again. Almost at the end. So this was number 200. Over to the nice stuff. Icons, conkeys, cursors, theme. speed thanks source watch everything went fine regarding speed and uh, themes and not to forget the breeze snow cursor theme which I like so much and just the auto font and that's that we have 500 Samba, let's skip this one. 600 is my personal settings. Copy pasting Art Colora, making some folders to check the scripts, what's inside. And now it says do not run script 700 before starting Firefox. So this is really the last thing I can do here. I have to reboot and finally I'll look at my Arch Linux GNOME. And let's make that also a beautiful eye candy desktop so that's nice don't forget i have put in here view scale factor so you, for you guys to see so this is the normal kind of scale check out this one so gnome classic xorg see what you choose and sign in there we go and we can also go full screen mode so we're working on virtual box linux mint inky point one let's go full screen remember the right control f switch and here we are on our new system ugly as hell so let's make it more beautiful we have something that tweaks our system there we go again zrt keys let's do the settings first settings <coughs> If you know one gnome you know them all region and language plus and then other belgian 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 luckily we're in the beginning of the list belgian add done close we were talking about tweaking things tweak tool and we're gonna add this one to the favorites so we have it already we want to have everything dark let's take arc dark red why not this one and then let's take something that goes with it like for instance the sardi monocolora pom, 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 the vampire which is also a little bit red and breeze snow nothing to select here and the desktop i wanted to show 
at the icons but actually don't show them I want to be able to work on it so now I can and you, you can select other things here but let's stick to what I really want we can change other stuff in another tutorial regular okay okay this one not all sounds regular 11 let's keep 11 I think it's a bit small actually can't see anything here but not all sounds regular 12 here we can see what happens with 12 and let's keep everything as it is so now we have this there is one to be fixed here as you can see I think I saw something else that was red but that's maybe normal yeah that's Nemo that's normal I did not know I had installed Nemo okay so GNOME comes with Nautilus of course not Nemo so when we run this we are actually running no problem files so that's okay that's it that's uh, how it should be did I install Nemo yes I did too so both file uh, managers have been installed I can switch if I want to I could install Tunar file manager from XFC as well so that's up to you if you want it or not uh, anyway the, the, the normal connection uh, files the normal link here is still the same it's still Nautilus which is file here so that's fine with control zoom in control scroll I can make it a little bit smaller and bigger that's good enough for me and uh, let's save some other stuff for the next tutorial getting out of the system again control right control and then F full screen is off and I'm gonna go shut down our system here like so power off and we are shut down 